okay uh, in previous video i explained you how to give numbering uh, and uh, in this video i will show you how to generate assembly drawings so after giving numbering next important step is uh, generating assembly drawings so before that i will uh, check whether numbering is done perfectly or not for example if i took a column you just uh, go for enquire assembly see you got column number c1 in the same way i will check whether uh, it is done whether numbering is done for this horizontal place or not for example you just go for enquire so it takes time and uh, so it just depends upon the processor of the system and uh, see here you can see assembly position hb2 so hb means horizontal brace so numbering is done okay numbering is done perfectly you can also check for this vertical brace also uh, you can just uh, go for the uh, enquire uh, assembly uh, it just take time uh, for instance so you can just uh, see so it, it just takes time it's common and uh, so in this way see you can see vb8 so vb stands for vertical brace so it is a sequence number given to it so numbering is done perfectly so the next step is generating assembly drawings so for that you just go for drawing properties you just go for assembly drawings in that you just you assign the name if at all if you if you want to generate beams you just uh, type beams for example beams and you go for layout in layout assembly drawings okay fine and uh, if you want to change you can just change to size as uh, 18 is to 24 and you can keep whether if you want to keep uh, 24 and also you can keep 18 so it doesn't matter here size so you can keep apply okay and uh, apply okay and after that at the bottom you can see the selection filter right here in selection filter you just select and delete everything what's what's here okay so by using this only we will uh, generate drawings so you go for add rows you just take part name equals value and if you click here in the value you get this automatically and here at the bottom you can see select from the model and you select this select from the model and now you just select the beam okay what you want to create okay so it got selected apply okay and now you just do this you just drag it and all the beams get selected. See, you can see here only beams get selected not columns okay now all the beams will get the numbering see you can see horizontal braces also not got selected only beams got selected now what you will do is you just go for create drawings and create assembly drawings so in this way assembly drawings are going to create it is the same process same thing you can do for columns same thing you can do do for horizontal braces and vertical braces also so the process is same uh, it takes some time uh, while generating uh, drawings and uh, after that if you're, uh, you you can just see in the drawing list uh, all the drawings uh, got created same thing the process is same if you want to create columns if you want to create beams the process is same you, you just delete everything what is there and uh, you just uh, select the model what you want and repeat the process it's same